Hello, hello, and welcome to another episode of Manhunt Checkpoint. Today we're doing the same map as in the uh, in the last couple of runs. This is the one with one of the ones with the multiple checkpoint things. So each one of these has each checkpoint has two positions you can take the checkpoint from. One is in a silly, silly place, and there's basically no way to get to it. And that's the primary, and that's the one that distances are measured to. And the other one is in a slightly more sensible place, and is the one I'm expected to take. And the reason we've done it like this is because then it means it makes it a little bit harder for the hunters to tell just how close the um, the prey is to the checkpoints. And so it gives me a little bit more of a chance to try and sneak in there and get them without being without it being quite so easy for the hunters to tell where I am. As always, I'm uh, supposed to go around and try to get all of the checkpoints without getting, um, well, try to get all of the checkpoints. There's no real withouts in there at all. Um, but the hunters are all trying to stop me from doing that. So they're going to do things like, if they spot me, they, if they work out who I am, then they're going to try and push me off the road. They're going to try and smash my car up. They're going to try and shoot me, that sort of thing. But they do have to get out of their cars before they're allowed to shoot. And in return for that, I'm not allowed to uh, use any sports or supercars. So this one here I'm using at the moment is a felon, I believe. Um, Okay, it doesn't tell me, even in this race mode, that's a shame. Um, pretty sure it's a felon, um, which is a coupe class, so I'm allowed to use this one, it's absolutely fine. <clears throat> it's basically the best sort of car that I'm allowed to use. And we do this because we've decided that having slightly slower cars makes the game a lot more interesting. With the supercars, you tend to have very, very high speed chases that tend to end very quickly in a crash or just things going out of control, or alternatively, with the... Um, with the prey losing the hunters just because they've managed to get around a corner, put their foot down, and then there's no way to see where they've gone. So we reckon that having the the hunters in coupes and the prey in nothing better than a coupe works quite well. And that means most of the time I will, if I can, I'll try to use a coupe. If I can't find a coupe, then maybe I'll use a, a muscle car if I have to. Sometimes I'll use sedans, maybe even the odd SUV, but the SUVs tend to be pretty terrible. They've all got fairly poor stats. So I try to avoid those, with the possible exception of the Radius, which I sort of, I don't know, I guess I use that almost as a sort of out of habit these days. Because it's, it's stats-wise, it's not that great, but it's a reasonably subtle car, so I um, often try and get away with those. So the name of the game for me is to try to blend in with the rest of the traffic. And that way, hopefully, the hunters won't notice me until it's too late. And I'll, so that's why I'm sitting here at these traffic lights, waiting for them to turn green like this. I'm also getting fairly close to the first checkpoint now. So at the end of this road, I'm going to turn left and head up the hill, grab the, um, the checkpoint that's sort of on the, on the opposite side of the, of the uh, gorge from the casino. And then I'm going to try and head up, carry on straight on from there, and go carry on northwards, out, almost out of the city. Um, because that way, hopefully if one of the hunters has taken the checkpoint in, in an attempt to try and work out when I take it, they won't actually notice me going through it because I'll be further away from the next checkpoint than they are reasonably soon. That's the hope, anyway. Um, in practice, it doesn't often work like that, but I can at least try, try that theory and, 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 and hope for the best. So there's not far to go now. I'm just waiting for this. There we go, there's a green light. Not far to go now. As I said, I get up to the end of this road, then turn left. Or follow it round to the left, rather. I'm going to run this red light. I've waited around long enough recently. Is that a purple car behind me? I'm not sure. So, I need to head up here, across this junction. That's convenient. Light's going green. Excellent. Carry on to Lemperer. I know you're a bit slow, but if I follow along behind this car, then I know I'm driving at a sort of a, an appropriate AI-type speed. Oop. Although not really an AI type lane discipline. That's a bit of a shame. I'm still not very good at... Oop, there goes one of the hunters. I'm still not very good at actually maintaining my lane... Uh, maintaining a smooth curve so when I go around corners. It's harder than it looks. <laughs> right, okay. So there's going to be a welcoming committee waiting for me up here, I suspect. Because that purple car is Tristan. He's one of the hunters. And there are two more of them as well, who I suspect... Well, Mike's always in an orange car. I can't remember what colour Buck usually goes for, but he's probably going to be around somewhere. But you can see the um, the checkpoint up there on the top of the hill. That's what I'm aiming for. That's what I, where I need to get to. The other check, the other primary checkpoint is up there on the top of that ludicrous um, thing over to the right. Uh, that's why I'm not going to go and take that one because that would be silly. 
Oh, I don't like stopping this close to a checkpoint. It's a green light. I'm going to go for it. Any hunters? I see no hunters. I think I've probably just given myself away. Yes, they're, they're definitely behind me now. And that was a weird lane wibble there. So, okay, the chase is on. Now, I'm, as I said, I'm in a reasonably good car this, for once. Oh, um... So, I might have a chance. We shall see how it goes. And I'm going to head away from the city because that's a sort of different. And that way, if I go up here, then the hunters are going to have no idea where they are because I've got no idea. Oh, alternatively, I'm just going to spin around in a circle because I've lost traction. Um, in theory, if I go up here, the hunters will have no idea where I am because I'll have no idea where I am because we don't normally play in this sort of area. Um, so, the upside is, yeah, as I say, there's... It's much harder to describe where I am to call the other hunters in. Uh, the downside, from my point of view, is that there are a lot fewer roads to take. So it's going to be much harder for me to lose him because I'll be a bit more obvious. However, I could... Whoa! Try going off-road. Like that. And he's overshot, which is nice. The question is, can I get up here... He's shooting at me. That's not good. Ow. Duck. Hide. Right. Okay, so because he's got out of his car and started shooting, I reckon I should ooh, be able to do some sort of massive jump over those trees. It's not the, quite what, how, what I intend to do. Let's go off the side of here instead. There's a road down there. That's quite nice. I like roads. <laughs> ooh, that was quite a good landing. Pleased with that. Now from here... Let's head back in towards the city again. My car's a little bit beaten up, but hopefully that won't be too noticeable. I'm going to go quickly at this point and try and get back to the sort of city area before he does. In fact, let's go on the highway down here. Oh, that was a less... That was a significantly less good landing. Come on, GTA Physics, turn the car back over for me. Right, so my intention there <laughs> was to jump drop down onto the highway but it turns out there's some big concrete barriers around the um, around the highway exit so that didn't work quite as I intended still never mind <laughs> I've made it down here now so I'm back on the highway and heading back into the city and I'm pretty sure I've lost the hunters at this point I did take a few bullets um, that's not ideal but but I got away right so now I can start thinking about the second checkpoint that's sort of in in the downtown area, which isn't far away. It's if I carry on along here and go through the big tunnel ahead of me, then I'll be more or less in the right place. Now the thing is, yeah, this tunnel here. So I but I want to change my car because this one is a little bit beaten up. I'd like to have something that's in better condition. I, no, I did no, not that. Uh, get the... Oh, damn it, GTA control system. Okay, what else? What, what am I going to be offered next? What are you? That looks like a muscle car. That might be okay. This is a, a Figaro. Okay, I don't know what the Figaro is like. I'm not sure if I've ever driven one of these before. But I'm pretty sure it's either a muscle car or a sedan. So I'm going to risk it and see how it goes. Now, I'm currently in first place. And that means I'm not allowed to take the next checkpoint. Because we, we have a rule in this game that the prey is only allowed to make a bid for the next checkpoint, or only allowed to start taking trying to take the next checkpoint when they've been in fourth place. So I don't have to be in fourth place when I take it. That's virtually impossible because the, the hunters will probably have been trying to get a, get closer to it. Or No, I will probably be closer to it than the hunters when I take it. So, take, so being in fourth place when I take it, not realistic. Having been in fourth place at some point, that's quite possible. So I'm going to sort of just lurk around here in the um, in these sort of dock areas, um, sort of industrial area. Oh, it started doing the zoomy thing again. That's really annoying. Um, yeah, so I'm going to lurk around here until my position drops a bit, drops all the way down to fourth. So there is a problem I have observed with with GTA, which is extremely annoying. Uh, turn the headlights off again. Um, where sometimes the game gets confused as to whether it should be in mouse and keyboard mode or controller mode. And that seems to lead to a few glitches. Namely, uh, whenever I put the brakes on, it 
Oh, it stopped doing. Uh, whenever I put the brakes on, it, the camera zooms in. Whenever I try and run on foot, the it tries to make a recording. Uh, or whenever I duck, it tries to make a recording like that. Um, I do still duck, I think. Yes, I do. Um, and also, the camera doesn't behave itself properly. And that's really annoying, because it makes it quite hard to play the game. Um, so, I'm not really sure why. what causes it to do that, what causes it to get confused like that. Um, but, I don't know, I'm going to have to gonna have to live with it the worst part probably because I haven't the other two problems the um the zooming in is just annoying the record the recording doesn't really matter but the camera not behaving itself can be quite awkward during a chase because sometimes it can end up pointing the camera in the wrong direction and making it really hard to tell what the car's doing um, in fact that might be why it was quite so weird and spirally when I was uh, going down that down the mountain over there earlier and I don't really know how to fix that Sometimes restarting the game seems to help, and in fact, when I started this run, it seemed to be okay. But then other times that doesn't seem to help, and I obviously can't restart the game now. Sometimes unplugging and plugging the controller back in seems to help, but I've just tried that and it didn't help either. So it's yeah, it's a bit annoying. Um, where am I? I'm down there. Okay. Right. Let's head over for the next checkpoint now. So I've been fourth. You all saw that. I'm back in third now, but I have been in fourth. So if I head along here, uh, let's see. If I go, right, so if I get to this first square of squares and um, exit, right, right turn, carry on two more blocks and then turn right, that'll bring me up quite close to it. Or I could take the, the right turn before that and try and do an alleyway sneak. That can work. So this is the one at the end of square, second half, second end of square of squares, far end of square of squares. It's English good. So this, I think, is the yeah, that's the there's square of squares there. So I'm at the southeast corner of it at the moment, or off the southeast corner. So if I go to the next one, turn up there, and then I can turn left into an alleyway if there are no hunters around. And that will either make me really obvious or really well hidden. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> so I'm going to turn right here. Because this is America, I'm going to turn right on a red light, because I believe you're allowed to. Pull over into this lane. There goes a hunter. Pull across here into this alleyway. Now, the... The checkpoint is just out of here and to the right. Now, it's a bit of a... There he goes again. Okay. Let's lurk here for a moment. If we see that hunter go back again, then maybe I'll make a run for it. I kind of part of me wants to go up that ladder and see if I can take it from the roof, but I'm pretty sure I can't. Okay, he's just gone again. Here we go. And coming out of an alleyway, I'm going to be really, really obvious. So I'm just going to go at speed. Oh, I thought I was just about going to get missed by Mike there, but not quite. Okay, so there, the chase is on again. I, I as I said, the um, the alleyway trick is good fun, but. It's not the most um, subtle way of ways of uh, doing something. Now I seem to have a, have a speed on them, so I'm going to carry on going. This is presumably because this is a muscle car and therefore fairly quick. And given that, I'm going to drop down here onto the motorway. Now he's, he's, he's behind me still, and he seems to be catching up. But let's see what we can do. Let's see what this Vigoro can do. I've, as I say, I, it's not a car I know. Um, I do expect most cars to be slower than the the Windsor fireplace that's uh, following me. However, if I do this right, if I let off the accelerator a little bit, let him catch up, then hopefully I can... Oh, no, he got in behind me. I was going to try and end or break and manoeuvre him, but um, he got in the wrong place for me to do that. Which is a bit of a shame. Did he pull that one off? Yes, he did. Okay, let's weave back and forth a little bit between the sides of the road, where I can, like this. And that's not going to throw him off because he's quite close behind me now. Um, I'm running out of city. And whilst that's not a problem, it's, it's not against the rules for me to leave the city. Oop, unlike in uh, Controller, it's counterproductive. Oop. That was an attempt at a wind end, end a braking manoeuvre, but he's... He knows me too well. There's Buck as well now in the in the sort of the burgundy car. I need to 
I don't know what I need to, but I need to do something. Oh, this is this could be bad. This could be very bad. It's going to be shooting in a second because I think I saw Buck getting out of his car. Yep, there we go. It's shooting, and I've hit that issy. Can I get off the road? No, I can't. I've missed. Ah! Do something sensible. Maybe I can get up here. No, I can't get up there. I am completely wedged. What if? What if I get out? Oh, no, he came up and got me. Ah! I just got completely stuck there. I was trying to find a way to escape, but it just wasn't happening. I was about to try and get out of the car, but that probably wouldn't have helped. Oh well. Who's the orange car? Mike. I'm just south of the checkpoint. Just second. Blue. And third. He's. I'm second, so he might have gone through. If nobody's first. Mike's oh no, I'm third right. now, so he's not. He's not past it. Uh, I've just gone third, second. That's us, I think. You're first, aren't you, Buck? I'm first now. I won't yeah. be for long. Okay, he's. Yeah. So there was a really car speeding up the highway. On the other side, or on the highway, yeah. Yeah, there was a car speeding up the highway earlier. Didn't register it properly. I've just You're gone still fourth. fourth I am still I'm, first, yes. I am fourth here. Yeah. I'll uh, I'll make a note once I stop being first. So he's not coming from the, the east. I'm second. He's in first, he's just taking the checkpoint. I'm I'm suspecting this car, but I'm not certain. That's him. Which car? The heading north from the checkpoint. Heading north from the second checkpoint. So the swerve he did round me was very on AI. Yeah. North it's along the highway? No, he's not on the highway, although he might be about to be. How uh, long the highway? He's he's heading out of the city. He's going right. up the hill though to the left, not into the theatre area. One after that. Right. Uh, he's he's delayed slightly because he's stuck. Just follow that round, and you'll be heading back south again. Still heading up. Not the third wheel. Oh, I'm correct. It's yeah. the next one. We're heading up towards the Vinewood side. Right. Okay. I'm heading towards the Vinewood side. Oh I'm no, he's going off road because he suspects my car can't handle it. Can your car handle it? We'll find out. Where, where, whereabouts exactly? Uh, I don't know. We're way off road. Oh, the way of road uh, area. Heading towards Pinewood. Fine. I'm not sure. I've, I've hit him a few times with bullets, but not enough to kill him. Uh, where are we? I may have lost him because I don't, I don't currently see him. I think he's currently fourth. I'm fourth. I'm third. Okay, yeah. Oh, he, he's, oh, he's come out of an alley east of it, heading straight for it. Yes, that one. That red one. Red, a uh, dark red muscle car. Yeah, maybe. Muscle car, I'm not sure. Probably. Yes. That's well, it. it's quite fast too. Yeah, a different red car. Got my way. Wrong way. 
Yeah, he's quite quick. Heading uh, west past Chinese Monument now. Heading uh, onto the highway by multicolored car park. Can you slow him down a little? Uh, I haven't caught up yet. So heading east along the highway. I was keeping up until the highway turned. I'm on the highway. Incredibly slowly catching up with him. Can you do it quicker? I'm trying. I can't pull the trigger any further safe. to accelerate. As, as long as you're able to... There we go. I, ra I rammed him That's and fine. he lost control a little. Are you still on the highway? Yes, he switched over to the wrong side of the highway, but he's still heading east. Alright. Are you behind him still? Yep. Switching a little. He's switching over to the correct side of the highway again. I think he wanted to Oops. take that jump, but there was a car on the way. Okay, he's coming off the highway. Oh, where is this? Uh, the place park. where it has to switch all the way to the other side. To buy LS Customs, I think. The closest highway jump to that. Yes, here, but. I thought I wanted earlier. He's reversing. He's turning around. Going back. Shots. Yep. Where are you guys now? Look at his tire. I've got him pinned. Approach and shoot him. Oh, yeah. Yep, I'm coming. Just, just run. He I'm running. He can't move. I'm coming. Just point at him. Press B. Point at him. Yeah, I wanted him to see my face first. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Um, well, no yeah. witnesses. Sorry. 